Hey guys, you cannot love God and money. Got a minute? Throughout this series, I've been putting up boundaries and borders of what you can't love God and do. And in order for me to do that and feel comfortable, I always have to lean on the things that Jesus says or the things that the Bible says directly. So this is what Jesus says. No one can serve two masters. Either you will hate the one and love the other, or you will be devoted to one and despise the other. You cannot serve both God and money. I read something the other day that said the thing that you spend the most time thinking about is the thing that you're worshiping. If you spend most of your time thinking about money, and how I'm gonna get money, or oh, this is the money I need, then you're spending more time worshiping or devoting time to money instead of God. Now, we live in a culture where materials and money and all this stuff is everything, everything that we need, but it's really not. The Bible even has more wisdom whenever it comes to money. Whoever loves money never has enough. Whoever loves wealth is never satisfied with their income. This too is meaningless. Everybody thinks maybe if I just get a little bit more money, if I could just get that raise, or if I could hit the lotto, and the thing about it is, that doesn't change anything. I've already done a whole video about how money amplifies you instead of change you. It just brings out those things that are inside of you. And so go back and look at that. But realize this, just as much of us thinking about, well, if the money that, it, you know, if I could get that much or, you know, like desiring money and stuff, whenever we think about our poverty state, then we are just as much influenced by money as we are if we're thinking about riches. The Bible even says that the love of money is the root of all evil. Because if you love money, then you'll do anything for it. And that is a slippery slope. And we know that God is a jealous God. He's not going to sit there and let you go back and forth between worshiping money and then saying that you're worshiping him. So you got to choose. Which one do you love? And I'd like to say there's nothing wrong with money in and of itself. It's the love of money that's the root of all evil. So work for it. Spend it. Use it the way that you're supposed to. Be good stewards, but don't love it. Don't worship it. And if you find yourself struggling with this and you find your thoughts are constantly dwelling on money and finances and how do you improve your status, then I just recommend, if this is convicting to you, that times that you're spending thinking about money, I want you to say, no, I'm going to spend this time thinking about God. Flip them. Start praising God in those moments. Start spending time with him whenever you are in your mess of, of stressing about finances because God is bigger than your finances. Thanks for taking a minute.